Hello everyone, welcome to Glibit, my name is KB and today I will show you the quick fix for the Adobe Premiere Pro if you are getting this problem called the, you know, whenever you import or sometime you will experience while you import, just import your video, you will see there is the audio and video out of sync and sometime you will notice while editing, sometime if you export the video then watch the video later then you will see there is a out of sync audio and video. So how to fix them? So for that, uh, first you, we have to know that why is it happens you know why this happens when you use the adobe premiere pro cc and some if you import the same video in other video editors like sony vegas and uh, cyberlink video editor or maybe there are lots of video editors that is problem caused by the you know all the other programs supports the variable frame rates vfr and the adobe premiere pro doesn't support the variable frame rate variable frame rate okay let me show you the quick thing how to see if your video is variable frame rate vfr or the constant frame rate cfr okay when you add the your video what you have to do is just right click here and uh, go into the media info and if you don't have this media info option then download the media if info from the google just type their media info and download this one and look down until you see frame rate bit rate doesn't matter bit rate if you have a variable bit rate or constant it doesn't matter just a frame rate now look at the highlighted media info frame rate mode variable frame rate 30 0.090 fps and maximum frame rate we have, minimum uh, frame rate we have the 20 fps and the uh, maximum frame rate we have the 31 fps and the original frame rate we have the 30 fps so first thing is how does the frame rate works like you know in one second how many frames it can play for example in one second there is a 30 frames per second that's what the thing is 30 frames it can play 30 frames in uh, one second but they are variable frame rates sometime in one second they will play the 20 frames sometime it will play the 30 frames that was what the variable frame rate is and the constant frame rate means the regularly even you know regularly playing uh, in one second regularly playing a same uh, frame rate for the each frame you know each second that's what the vfrs and cfr is variable frame rates mean the in one second there is a different frame rate are playing and constant frame rate means the in one second same frame rate is being played in every second okay once you know that you have a variable frame rate that does not support with the uh, adobe premiere pro cc it needs a constant frame rate then you will not have that issue of saying that video is out of sync or you will notice that video is out out of sync so how to fix that the simple fix is you have to make it a constant frame rate so constant to make a constant frame rate you have to uh, you know convert the video to vfr to cfr so there is a programs lot of programs there is a paid and lot of programs so there is a i have a one program which i always use if i need to edit in premiere pro that is handbrake handbrake this is a free program absolute free program it is also available for the uh, mac and windows so you can use in both it doesn't matter what windows you have and then what you have to i'm gonna do a quick uh, tutorial for you how to make it constant frame rate to uh, you know fr a variable frame rate to constant frame rate source and select your file and i'm gonna select my file this was the constant this was the vfr frame rate so uh, in picture section make it strict and in filter leave it as it is and video section select the codec your co desired codec it doesn't matter what codec you want to use and frame rate this is where it begins in frame rate just select the your desire it might be in your case it might be 60 it might be 30 you know in my case it is 30 frames per second so as you can see there is inside just below that there is a constant frame rate and peak frame rate so 
peak means the variable frame rates constant means the uh, CFR constant frame rate so you just have to select the constant frame rate and other settings are common you can leave it as it is and the quality you can make it constant or you can select your average quality like 10,000 16,000 you know it depends on you and after that you just have to hit on start like this and it will start to process your video and it will be the uh, constant frame rate video i'm gonna show you a demo within a second when it finishes the converting it and then we're gonna browse the media information again and we will see that video will be the constant frame rate okay when it's done uh, converting the uh, your video and then just exit out and uh, hey Z, this is my original video with the you know we're gonna go into the media info and we will see that the frame rate mode is still the variable frame rates okay so this is one video with uh, not converted and this one is the converted one okay media info and go here and you will see frame frame rate okay here it is the frame rate mode as you can see here constant and here we have the variable and the constant so when you use this constant uh, frame rate mode video then it will be in perfect sync it will not be uh, unsync video or the out of sync video in the adobe premiere pro so that's how you use the variable frame rate to adobe premiere pro you have to convert the variable frame rate video to constant frame rate to use in premiere pro and that's all that's all how you fix the you know out of sync uh, in audio premiere pro out of sync video and audio in other way premiere pro i will put link in the description for that free program and that one is also the best uh, you know video converting program free program and fastest free program and uh, it does not you know it does not uh, give you a bad quality it will give you a lossless quality of the video so you can convert the video to uh, variable frame rate to constant frame rate to add it in adobe premiere pro so that's how you fix it and hope you enjoyed it if you did leave a like comment and subscribe and yeah i will see you in the next one take yourself and have fun bye bye